Hi guys, welcome to the short video about the question if the Vice Cam Outdoor is capable to record. I mean, uh, I'm talking about uh, alarm recordings or like a VSTP IR, the passive infrared detection when it detects something and it is offline actually. So we have the Vice Cam Outdoor outside, battery operator, no problem with that. And we have the base station here inside it is wired but uh, what is going to happen when we unplug it here so this could happen for uh, different reasons i mean like power outage or so of course yeah usually you would also lose then power here but you could uh, prevent that technically uh, when you have this powered by the power by a power bank you could uh, power this uh, through a power bank something like that and uh, then it, uh, you can use path through so you have a couple of hours where you have power on your camera and power here on the base station so technically it's no problem so what will happen uh, when it's on power we have sd cards here and we have one in the camera but we don't have internet this is a question which somebody has been asking me and it's a uh, i mean it's a legit question i think and it was already a problem with the blink xt and xt2 as far as i remember i've tested this once and it didn't record so when there was no power on the base station or the communication module and uh, no internet connection it didn't record because there is no uh, memory no storage uh, not in the camera not in the base station so here it's different we can have storage so we can insert an sd card in the camera and also in the base station so how is it i've tested this here you can see that and start playing this and you can see that i removed yeah the quality is really bad i mean i didn't want to wait till google has converted this but uh, still you can see that i think you get a point here the camera is offline here you can see the plug of the ethernet cable and at the beginning it was still uh, blue for some time yeah, i go back a little bit steady blue for some reason so uh, but anyway i went outside and it was already offline and so i was waving a little bit with my hand in front of the camera i mean the camera is not affected it's battery operated so i went back to the base station and in the meantime the base station found out that it's offline yeah, it started blinking and uh, yeah so the question is then of course what happens when we uh, connect it back will it be synced then to the cloud from uh, either the sd card here or from the sd card in the camera so what's actually going to happen here we have the result so anyway you can see that now it's offline i was checking then the app after that and so here's the result and when we go to the app you can already see my hand here yeah, I was going then to the camera not needed but I went then to the recordings uh, event recording you can see that here so it was definitely here it was recording uh, in full length like uh, 11 seconds as it was supposed to be and during this time it was already I mean the base station was already offline so we can definitely confirm that the vice cam outdoor is uh, capable to record also while offline this is a huge advantage yeah so you can definitely see that this is working at least in this configuration with uh, power still on on the camera that's no problem but also uh, with the base station still powered and after this test i've been thinking okay why not to try the whole thing or do the uh, test without having power on the uh, base station so i really uh, did not only uh, unplug the ethernet cable but also unplug 
the uh, power here fully so it there was no power no nothing no connection and i thought okay we have the micro sd card in the camera it should be capable to record something and after i power on the base station again it should be able to transmit to the base station then to the internet to the cloud and the result unfortunately was that it didn't work so there was nothing here i checked in the footage again after that well uh, same thing as in the first time and the uh, first time yeah i had footage second time without power on the base station there was no footage here super disappointing but at least we have a case where we can manage to uh, like survive uh, power outage and have still all the footage saved when we have still the base station powered on and what i had uh, in the camera when you go to the setting when you go to the camera and go to the setting you can activate like uh, backup to the base station so there's a like recording setting like you go to the setting then recording setting and then you activate uh, backup to the base station this is what i had activated i don't know if it makes a difference i haven't tried it but at least uh, we can be sure in this configuration it will work what i can recommend for you this is this uh, power bank it's a little bit expensive but i can guarantee that this works for pass through charging uh, that's uh, not possible with every power bank so you can uh, have the power uh, input and power output here so no problem with power outages for a couple of hours maybe even days because this is really powerful this is a, a really strong nice power bank yeah it's it, it's an amazing thing uh, you can see a lot of people have been buying this already even though it's a little bit expensive it's one of the best power banks i've ever seen and on top of that what i can recommend also is some quality micro sd cards like samsung evo uh, that's a thing which i usually buy the here's a nice five pack pretty cheap five times uh, 32 gigabytes and the huge advantage is that it is uh, really uh, nicely recovering every error i mean if uh, you're recording let's say on your camera and there's a power outage i mean the battery drains almost instantly on the camera and so you have a corrupted file on your camera or base station or wherever you have problem uh, with the samsung with this uh, micro sd card there's the biggest chance to be able to recover any footage when you buy just no name uh, super cheap chinese micro sd cards you can save a little bit of money but at the end you will lose your footage it's not worth uh, a lot of people think there's no controller built in in the micro sd card that's not true there are controllers in, in uh, included in the micro sd cards and uh, based on the logic of it uh, you will be able to record footage or not and with the samsung you have the best uh, likelihood so i'll put down the links to this cards here and to this nice power bank uh, into the description so you can check it out and if you and if you uh, decide to uh, go for uh, this configuration here so you can check these things out ordered right from there from amazon and yeah i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments or maybe other opinions on that maybe you have your own experience would be really interesting if you could leave your feedback down uh, below and i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time